Dr. Ian Smith recently released his 26th book, Eagle Rock, the fourth installment featuring Chicago-based private investigator Ash Kane. Yeah, he joins us more with now with more on this novel. Your 26th book. Yeah, 26th, How book, fourth installment. Um, I just love to write. <laughs> okay. And I like creating story, and uh, and it's a lot of fun. Particularly this this series is a lot of fun for me because it's Chicago-based. Yeah. yeah. So it's all about us here in Chicago. It's our streets, um, and. I love that we can have a guy like Ash Kane. Because, you know, when you look at detective series, Michael Connolly has Bosch in L.A. Mm -hmm. Robert Spencer had, uh, uh, Robert Parker had Spencer in Boston. Mm -hmm. Harlan Coben has uh, Wit in uh, New Jersey. We never really had somebody. Yeah. yeah. So I created this character because I'd never seen someone like this in books or on the screen. And so Ash Kane is our guy in, LA, in Chicago. Uh -huh. Uh, all right. How, first of all, how does it feel? New York Times best-selling yeah. author. I mean, it's got to make you feel great. Well, I, I don't know. You know, awards and stuff are cool. But what's, what's cooler is when people will send me a message on Instagram and say, I just finished. I was up to 2 o'clock in the morning <laughs> yeah. trying to figure this thing out. I was in the gym the other morning, and a Chicago businessman named Jim Reynolds sent me a message while I'm working out. He's like, dude, you have a crazy imagination. I just finished the book, and oh. I kept going to the end. And that's what, as a writer, that's what I want. I want you, I want, it's fast-paced. Lots of twists and turns, and I want you guessing to the very end. Okay, because that's that. my question. Okay, so yeah. it's a death investigation, yeah. and the lead character, Elliot, was in his 70s when he died. Yes. <laughs> and then they start investigating his death, potentially as a murder. And the things that you come up with when you're looking at the backstory of the deceased guy, I was like, Dr. Ian, what's your, what, what are you thinking about, man? Well, well the beauty of writing fiction yeah. is that I can go places with my imagination that in my normal, relatively boring life, I would never go. Right. But that's why it's so much fun versus writing my health books. In this case, Elliot Cantor is a billionaire in Chicago. He's found in a compromising position in his secret apartment in Lincoln Park. Mm -hmm. um, and the son is there talking to the commander on the scene, Rory Burke. And Burke says, pulls him aside, hey, listen, there's one guy that can really help solve this. He works quietly, efficiently, with no restrictions. It's Ash Kane. So Ash comes on the scene uh, at Lincoln Park at 2 o'clock in the morning at a building that exists, by the way. All, all the places are real. Are, are, are real places. And he goes and he's investigating why this guy was found in this very compromising position. I yeah. love that fact, too, that everything, as you say, based in Chicago, Chicago streets, right. restaurants, buildings, that's well, you know, obviously... You know some of these TV too. shows that oh are Chicago-based? Oh, yeah, right. Yes. It's Drives so much fake. Nuts. It's yes. so wrong, right. right? First of all, that street doesn't go that direction. Right. You know right. what I mean? Right. When they say, like, East on Lakeshore Drive, it's like, oh, wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> well, and I'm sure you they, when you watch medical stuff, too, you're like, that um, hasn't really happened. Yes, yeah. yes, throw yes. Something so, TV. so I like writing these because I can really present Chicago, our restaurants, and people who are not from Chicago, when they finish reading the book, they're like, geez, I felt like I was in your city. Yeah. Um, I, can, I can smell it, I can hear it, I can see it. And Ash Kane is the kind of guy where one minute he's quoting Shakespeare, next minute he's quoting Biggie Smalls. Uh, he, goes, <laughs> he goes to the west side, yeah. he goes up north, yeah. uh, he likes to play golf all over the city. So I just think it's a lot of fun for Chicagoans because this is our guy. Well, do you ever layer in, like, big news stories into some of these? Because this feels like there might be a big news story behind. Yeah. So, yeah. you know, a lot happens in Chicago, as we all know. Right, right, right. So it's very easy to pull content yep. from things. I change things a little bit. You know, I yeah. kind of embellish and I take things away. But a lot of these are our stories, you know. Mm -hmm. And um, I just read something where I won't mention because I don't want someone else to write it, where this crazy thing happened. That, and I, what I do is I, when I hear these stories, I put them in my notes. Oh, uh, that's smart. I'm like, oh, wow, yeah. this could be like a good foundation for for another book. So, yeah. Um, so yeah, a lot of these things kind of come to fruition out of what's really happening in the headlines. Oh, and, I, and you're going to keep the series going, right? Yeah. There's more for Ash Kane and for... Number five is already written. It's called, oh. it's called The Alderman. Oh. Uh, <laughs> so you can imagine right there, <laughs> yeah. right? We do um, have some good material. Yeah, right? I'm saying. <laughs> and by the way, the cover of this, um, if you look at the cover, oh, yeah. whoever can come up with where that statue is and who created it, and send me a message on Instagram, oh. at Dr. Ian Smith, spell the doctor out, Ian Smith, where it is, the name of it, and who created it in our city, then I will send you a free copy of Eagle Rock. Ooh. And my next health book, which is called Eat Your Age, that comes out in January. Okay, I have to admit, this one is not super familiar. I think I know, but I won't say. Okay. Don't say. I'll, I'll okay. Tell me after, and, okay. then I'll, and then I'll read the book. Okay. Okay, so your next health book you said is coming out in January? In January, it's called Eat, Eat Your, your age. age. Yeah. Oh, God, I, I don't want to know what my age I'm supposed to no, be No, no, no. It's, okay. No, the idea is your, every decade of your life, yeah. there are certain foods you should be eating, okay. certain tests you need, certain exercises that are good for your age. Okay. So it's all about figuring out what's best in your decade. Okay, well, I also want to ask, are you... Are we talking about TV series slash movie? Well, it's been option. Fingers okay. crossed. Okay. Um, it's been option, so they're working on it. I just actually posted something um, to the fans saying, who should you cast as Ash Kane? So on my Instagram, so maybe people will give me some, some do advice. Do you have someone in mind? Do you have uh, a yeah. hopeful? 
I do. Okay. I do. I, I want someone who doesn't have a big name, by the way. Oh, I was saying, is that like a Idris, Lawrence Fishburne kind of a? No, he's too. I was thinking says, Denzel. Idris, okay. Yeah. Ever since Idris but Elba, know. you know, you want someone who can grow into the role. Oh, yeah. I got right. You. Who's a great actor, but yes. a younger but, actor. That's maybe. right. Yeah. And whose name doesn't and their history, their body of work doesn't take over the character. Yeah. Oh, I like that. Yes. Oh, yes. Yeah, cool. But oh. also, then, then they're free to do multiple. That's series. right. There you go. We're playing it for you. Okay. Yeah. 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 Consult me, please. Consult. Right. Doctor Ian, thank you so much. Doctor Ian Smith. Is where you can get more information on this one and the 25 others that he's written already, too. All Thank right. you.